Welcome back to another episode of Marimashita Irumakun. We're on season 2 and just when I thought that we're gonna go and solve the mystery of this. Who could this evil Iruma be at the end of season 1? Who is this Amity? I'm just tossed in for more questions. I, she got kind of just perfume. That's not a perfume. She got like gassed by some guy. Seems like Amity stalker. She's in this like super docile mode. So I guess... His goal was to make the strong and confident and like this like pillar of Babylus, right? Student council present to a really kawaii, just moe, submissive girl. And uh, honestly, honestly, I'm kind of down. I'm kind of down. I wonder how much memory she's lost or if she has even her personality has changed much other than her, I guess, overall aggressiveness. I don't know how long this is gonna last. Personally, I like the really strong, confident one because the contrast between that versus when we're alone with doing our little dates with Iruma, that's what really is like, uh, that's what I like about Amity. The contrast between the cool student council press and the private life that she has with Iruma. But this is gonna be a fun ride too. Iruma's ring is now sentient. It has intelligence. What was his name? Ali? But there was something more. When he was saying his full name, it was like, Ali Cred. Oh, you can just call me Ali. I'm like, I guess that name is pretty important. Probably a name of some kind of uh, super demon. I, I don't know. It's because like, you have like names like Belial, Sullivan. Uh, what, what, what was the other names? I forgot. Was it Lady Levi? Anyways, these seems like really important like demon names. Therefore, Ali Cred is probably a reference to something. And therefore, super important. Apparently, the ring... Well, we don't know much about the ring. Even Sullivan was like, why don't you just be a ring that stores magic, right? But it's becoming sentient. It has intelligence, and it's changing shapes. And my still theory is, right? So this could be completely wrong, but I gotta take a guess. Two options. Either the ring will continue to change as we rank up as it's been theorized, right? And as it changes shape, somehow it turns into evil Hiruma? I don't know. But then there's also that and the evil gauge of how demons, you know, they have like a stress bar. And that's what it's explained during the Demdoll art. You get more stressed and evil, they're during their evil cycle, and they need to be kicked in the head by Amari to return them to their normal self. I don't know, but because they're mentioning this mechanic again, and because it's, it was just like an important thing that we didn't even know in Season 1 until like the end, Seems like a combination of two, or maybe nothing at all, is the reason why Evil Iruma will become Evil Iruma. If that's even him, is it the same person? Is it Ali in a different uh, in different shape and Iruma somewhere else? I don't fucking know. Let's watch the episode, though. Oh, hey. Careful with that. Where the student council at? Put these whippersnappers into shape. Iruma, show up. The noble yet cruel demon elite, Amity. <laughs> Her ears are just droopy. That it's so good. It's so good. She's much more softer and kinder. I wonder how everyone else is gonna react to this, though. Mm, will they look down on her because she's no longer strong and cool? Or will they support this new soft Amity? Oh, Kamui is all into it, huh? Eiko is into it too. Oh, Eiko. Hello. How is she gonna approach Iruma differently now? Hmm, will she be more honest with her feelings? Is she not gonna be full tsundere anymore? Is she more just dere dere now, right? Hmm. Consider shutting down the student council. Hello. Yes. Oh, how thoughtful of you, student council prez. <laughs> they yes, let's just relax and have a good time. <laughs> I wanna stand, I wanna work. That's the, he's the only guy enjoying this. I'm so happy. <laughs> Dainty Amity. Okay, let's go. She looks smaller here. Good job. Doesn't she look way tinier here? Am I crazy? She's so slow, but so cute. She is so cute. <laughs> What's okay? No, not when you act like this! No! Who could say anything else? No, you're doing your best! No, you're doing your best! Yes, ma'am! 
問題もありませんよ隊長そうですか Okay, but it is true that she is completely different and kind of slowing down the process with it, uh, what it used to be, I guess, but it works five times tougher. Huh? The fuck? What's going on here? Is this? Huh? Romy. This is probably the stalker? Who is this? Ronovair Romiere. Romi. Uh, new character. Okay, sure. But probably the one that did this comedy. Why? To make her more dainty to... So that he could... After the present spot, like position of the student council? Like, he doesn't care about... <laughs> I don't know why like... Yeah, 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 you're super fabulous. I get it, I get it. For some reason, he reminds me of a character named Falco Fulgore from a series called Zatch Bell. I mean, he's even doing dances and he's doing like little music. It's <laughs> pretty good, actually. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> they really just hit us. You're the prince of the sun? Is that important? Like, they really just hit us with musicals out of nowhere. I thought it'd be like a Clara-specific thing, but... They had Clara, they had the Demdoll performance. <laughs> now we have Romy. It seems likely because the per... Maybe it wasn't him. Even though around the corner we saw rose petals everywhere. Wait, is he a... His legs are shaking. A man touched me for 6.6. This is too much? As in, like, it doesn't roll that way? <laughs> <laughs> okay, but like maybe it's not him. It's too obvious, don't you think? Because you were waiting for her to become dainty? Her authority was absolute. I, for some reason, still don't feel like he's the one that did it. It's too obvious now. Just gonna sniff at her hair. Oh! Iruma, hello! Watch who you're touching. That's my girl! Yes! But Clara, no! Uh, 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 0.6 seconds is too much too. It's always something 666. What a knight in shard and shining armor. Oh, Dainty Amin is so into it! <laughs> He's all over the place. Just an emotional roller coaster. Malice? No, that was very kind. <laughs> well, I guess we're gonna have a duel with them. It's kind of annoying with all the musical. Just... His voice is so amplified. Big campaign. Hello, commoners, look at me. <laughs> How much rose petals do you have? Holy shit. Uh huh? Everybody's looking at him suddenly. A golden light shines and everybody just... Wait, wait, wait. But they were all just passing by. Huh? He can draw people's attention with charisma. So his magic is to draw attention whenever he has his golden light. They all look just... Uh, yeah, they're not actually into it. It's... Because it's just... they look pretty bored and just they didn't care until drawing people's attention. <laughs> it just gets the attention. It doesn't compel them. Oh? Hold up. Yo, I like this platform. Yeah? No more tests? Half the class? He's gonna win free pizza lunch every day! I mean, our cafeteria food is already probably free, but... Uh, it's the people's champion right now. He has no... He doesn't give a shit about discipline. Yeah, can you actually do... It's just, no. I will not make any prop. Maybe we can do it, though. People champion is a fight the politician. But <laughs> come on, at least he's gonna try his best. Ah he's I kinda like him. He's a lovable idiot. I kinda like him. And I don't think it was him that uh made Amity like this. It's too obvious. Well, the current student council doesn't let you guys have any kind of fun, so 
Yeah, that can probably be delivered. Yeah. I have no idea what he's talking about. <laughs> he's pretty good. He's kind of charming, you know? He does have charisma, even though <laughs> in the beginning, no one really gave a shit. He just got the attention. It was like, whatever. Oh, I'm ready. No, you gotta command the audience, but... Oh, oh no. She's... They're just kind of just... Oh, this is not good. <laughs> oh my god. La 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 no <laughs> Oh no, he's getting to me. <laughs> he would get mad and annoyed, but then I bet he would actually help. Ow! We summoned him as a familiar? Okay, okay, it's just, it's just imagination. I think he would help. No, he would help. Even though he's super soon today, he would help. Amiri, behind you? What's up? Are you okay? What's up? Oh. Um, well, don't give me a cliffhanger. About what? What's Oh, Ali! You're finally showing yourself. You never show yourself in front of people to the point that people think that you're crazy. People think that even was crazy. It's like, what are you talking about? You know? It's he is real, right? Could you yeah, no, it's just a, it's it's a convenient excuse that he's not showing himself to everyone else because oh then he'd be experimented on. How convenient, right? But come on, show yourself to somebody so that I can confirm that you're real. He's just jealous for Iruma's attention. Mostly on those. How do you know? It's mostly undone, but there's some triggering. Opposites. Counters. The tough and cold exterior of Amity can't turn back because this is such a lovey dovey magic spell. What is it stuck on? What is the trigger? Such as... Oh! Convenient disappears, okay! He's real, absolutely- Oh, he's she's wearing her usual outfit! And her ears are back up. But then it's gonna droop down, right? Oh, wait! That's her normal voice?! What is it this time? Come on. No cliffhanger this time, because it's a new episode and... That's her normal voice. Ears droop immediately. <laughs> the outfit is embarrassing, but it's very powerful, I guess. It does show more skin, but she can't go into that, you know, her original form for a bit, and then she can't hold it anymore. It reveals too much. It, it did. <laughs> for like a second. <laughs> yeah, and then student council might actually get dissolved, and then that fucking clown. <laughs> Roaming. Well, everybody will have more fun, I guess, right? So, it's that benefit. Oh, the only one, though. Yeah, but but is Iruma more special than everyone else? So don't know anything about them, to be honest, because they kept their backstory a little secret. And you're not her anymore? No, don't be scared! Damn, seeing the strong, confident Amity like this is... Oh my god! Oh, this is hitting so much harder because who she usually is and... Oh, the worst scene is so vulnerable! That'd be pretty fun, actually. That sounds great, actually. Let's do it! Yeah, let's do that! If you... Accept her right now! For... Oh, holy shit! This is a straight up... That's her line in season one. Whole, whoa, whoa, what was the distinction between ideal and ambition? That's not a goal. That's not something. I would have just accepted it right there, but Iruma making a stand here. 
どんな困難も打ち破るその姿勢にみんな憧れていたんだと思います Don't your ambitions. あなたは自分の本当にしたいことをする Yeah, this is the proper way to do things それが生徒会でもできるなら、yeah. If I was him, I'd be like Tea party, let's fucking go Right now, every day, forever But It's Iruma He's not a simpin He's just him Always thinking about the best for everyone else and honestly, this might win her favor over even more now. Oh. This is some precious Iruma and Amiri scenes. Aww, this is too much for Amiri, man. Aww. Head flush. She touches your face all the time! Two birds flying together. I'm sorry, Clara. I'm sorry. <laughs> Clara, I love you, but I'm sorry. You're just gonna be a childhood friend at this rate. <laughs> oh my god, this is... It's unfair! And I love this, and I love these two, but it's... Poor Clara! <laughs> She's got no chance. She's got no chance. <laughs> there she is, speaking of the devil. Are we dueling? Everybody's stomping their feet. Are we dueling? Oh, these are the ranks. Oh! Yo! And it ends with Yod. This is kind of really epic. Oh, that was pretty cool! Holy shit, this is how a duel starts? The, the way they were chanting. Oh man, Rummy, this is ruined. <laughs> but the way they were chanting the ranks all the way from beginning to end. God damn, that was cool. Oh god, here comes the charisma. She's got everybody's attention, but remember, all it does is get attention. Nothing else. After they look at the attention- Oh no, they're kind of hyped for it, actually. Because again, he's, pr he's promising a bunch of bullshit. <laughs> We're gonna have so much more fun. Oh. Free pizza every day. Cut the classes in half. Vacation time. This place is gonna go into complete chaos, though, if we go that way. <laughs> Another musical. I mean... It does sound like school will be a lot more fun with him around. I'm not gonna lie. Who wouldn't vote for him at this rate? What could Amity possibly do to switch the tides? Like, what is she gonna promise? More discipline? Like, this is unfair. Well, it's not unf it's, it's, it's not unfair. It's completely fair. This is, you know, how you win elections, actually. It's how it happens in real life. You appease to what the people want, and you give it to them right there. What does Amity have? What could she offer? Can she even talk properly like this? She's getting drowned out. Kaligo, say silence right now! Kaligo! This is the perfect moment for him to say, Shikuni! This all looks so familiar? The trigger. Familiar. Okay, she's back. So her being in front of a big crowd, all of us... No, okay, she's coming back. Her ears are gonna perk up. I'm weak. No one can hear this, but this isn't really important. Yo, 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 guys. I'd like to think that, you know, the important characters are all hearing this right now. And who else has someone? Iruma! Slaps the mic away and she can reach the crowd even better. Was my desire. <laughs> Rip, but okay, she's back. The captain is back. For better or worse, I kind of like Dainty. I mean, I hope it comes back. I hope it fluctuates. What do you remember? I think you're plenty strong, but go on. The expectations everybody has around there, and then the imagery of the trigger happening. There she is. But that's very abstract and vague. He's promising, you know, we're gonna have more fun and pleasure, but he's like, I want to make this place the best, the best it can be. What does that mean? The demons are made of desire. Be proud of your desires. Okay, she's reaching them more. I mean, everybody looks shocked. What is your desires? Just like that? Everybody's forgotten Maromi. Think about your ambitions, your dreams, 
your goals. This is honestly what really compelled me about Amiri in season one when she was talking about ideals and ambitions to Iruma. This is pretty inspiring, yeah. Yeah. Everybody's forgotten about free pizza lunch already. Also, I don't think pizza, the concept of pizza exists here. It's gone. Damn! Just shut up and watch me! That was an excellent line. And she knocked away the mic. She was able to reach everybody without the mic, kind of showing that, you know, she's back, obviously. Look at her ears, though. Is it perked up? There you go. Huh? Yuruma. That's him right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one person that shines above everyone else. What are you realizing? Hmm? It's all thanks to Yuruma, yeah. But what is he to you? The first to receive all of them. She's clearly in love. Clearly. I, I, she seems like I'm in love. She confirmed it. She's actually admitting it. She had the question before of like, what is Iruma to me? And she's like, I don't know, a junior? Some kid that I make read shoujo mangas? She's in love. And rest in peace, Clara. <laughs> I mean, it is what it is. I think he just wanted to see Amity in a dainty form, to be honest. Not the downfall. No, he wanted to like see like the peak of Amity, like because he's such an Amity cultist. <laughs> no, it was to show the dainty side. <laughs> His ambition. <laughs> what was it? Yeah. Yeah. Honestly, I respect. I guess <laughs> it's his true ambitions. Oh, he's squeeing. Oh! There it is! Yes, you sounded very cool as usual. I like the dainty mode though. Can you hear my voice? Yes, absolutely. This is what. Yeah, pretty much. The fact that you're all flustered like this. And he's so cute and hot. Ah, I don't know what to call it. Oh, your hair. It's all messy. No, I love that you're bold, so that when you're cute sometimes, unexpectedly, it, it's even cuter. Another ambition. What's that? Iruma, you know, marriage? Um, oh, she's looking at Iruma in the picture. It's so good. And that's the end of the dainty Amity arc. Pretty fast, pretty quick. I thought that it might go on for longer, but I guess it's done. Although I would love her dainty side to return from time to time. Her ambitions. She has another ambition now. The first one is to protect Babilus, right? To make sure that this, this school is what it's supposed to be. And she wants the best out of it. And she wants like a good reputation for all the demons. That's what I think she said in season one. But the second ambition now, love marriage with Iruma she's questioned herself and I thought that maybe you know in these kind of series and like rom-com whenever whenever there's some kind of romance involved the author tries his best to stall as much as he can and to the point where like the character themselves will never confirm or admit that they are in love with another character they'll be like no what am I talking about I'm stupid Amini completely confirmed it holy shit it's on Amini Iruma is a thing and it was like that in season one too it was like it's pretty obvious how much the author seems to be pushing them together but <sighs> clara i'm sorry clara you're gonna be a you're just gonna be a childhood friend i i i i i, I don't know because there's fun <sighs> whatever whatever anyways if you didn't enjoy my reaction if you stick around this long you already know what i'm gonna say check out the other videos and playlists to my channel if you watch another video immediately after this one it helps you to push out my small channel to be recommended so that i have a chance to compete with some of your favorite reactors until next time guys take care